Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Phoenix, and today we're going to be watching The Legend of Giasi Zardas. This is a video that Austin FC has put out, I believe yesterday from when I'm recording this. Uh, I've just finished watching Austin FC beat uh, Vancouver, or sorry, beat Minnesota, excuse me, 2-1. Uh, Giasi Zardas didn't score. He's been in a great run of, run of form recently. He's just hit his 100th MLS goal, uh, yeah, MLS goal. Uh, in Verde and Black. I'll put a picture right now. I met Giassi's artist right before he started his scoring streak, so I'm taking credit for all your goals, Giassi. Good job. Congratulations. It's all because of me, clearly. All right, so let's take a look, see what Austin, the media team is outstanding like normal, so let's see what they have cooked up in this six-minute specialty of a video. I hear the, the lights go green. That's what some of the guys are telling me, like, oh, you can't wait till you see the stadium. It goes green. It's true. Uh, our supporters throw beer and water yep. everywhere. Very South American. And I'm like, man, I can't wait to get a glimpse of that. Me scoring for the first time and the announcer saying, Jossie's hard and the whole crowd just going crazy. You know, that's something I'm really looking forward to. I'm glad he got it. He was able to score at home. Too bad he didn't score his first goal at home. Too bad he was on the road, but I got to see it. I'm pretty sure I did. Did I? Did he score first at home? I'm not saying guessing. So this was at home, yeah. Yeah, this is first goal was at home. I saw a second, I think, in Seattle. For taking and now back off the bar and Home. It's a good goal. It's a good goal. I'm always trying to achieve things that people can't take away from you. For a striker, you know, scoring goals. When it comes to a team as a collective, you know, winning MLS Cups, um, nobody can ever take that from you. Um, your name is etched in the history yeah. books forever. My name is Jossie Zardes. Um, I started at LA Galaxy. I played for Galaxy for about five years. I got traded at the end of 2017 to Columbus Crew. Played under Wolfie uh, with Columbus Crew and learned so much from him within that one year I had him. I was like, you know what? I had one of the best seasons of my career, uh, 2018, when I played with Crew, and I yep. kind of was yearning for that feeling again. And, um, you know, I Austin, play with Wolf. Yeah. Like, hey, I mean, it makes really sense. And I was like, hey, I'll, I'll come. I think some of this footage was in some of the preseason videos that they've put out. It's super cool, all the behind the scenes stuff that we that we get to see from the club and with the new Apple TV deal and everything. Super cool. I'm running with medicine balls. You know, it's something special with this locker room because I feel like when you're with a group of brothers in a locker room and you're able to hang out and train together and still hang out outside of the field, but with all of our families together and not be annoyed with each other, that's something special. That's you really know, cool. that's a bond that's, that, really cool. that's only gonna grow, but only make the team stronger. Because I know that, you know, these guys know my personal life and they have my back and they accept me for who I am and vice versa. I accept them for who they are. And you know, that that makes that bond so much stronger here with Austin. I'll be going. Huh? You wanna be going? Okay. Nah, not with the goalie gloves. Well, hold on, May. Hold on, May. He's gonna kick it. Hold on, hold on, G. Hold on. Mommy, excuse me. Ooh, nice. No, you don't have to touch it. Just talking it. Say hello. Hello. Yeah. It hears everything you're saying. Hello. <laughs> Can you hear me? Yeah, please don't. It's so cool to see the like behind the scenes with their family and stuff. <laughs> good, good goal. It's a good goal. And then Jason is two. So eight. Yeah, or eight six four two. I always go top to bottom. I bent his finger last time because the only thing is I don't like him playing goalie. Yeah. So whenever he's in goal, I actually blast it. Goal! <laughs> Man, That's as a father and husband, for me, it's like I have my wife that depends on me. My kids depend on me, you know. My son made the uh, the Austin FC Academy, which uh, which is cool Congrats. for his little journey, you know. Um, but for myself, 
that gives me even more motivation. When I step on the field at Q2, he's gonna be watching, he's in the stands, you know, he's watching my every move, how I interact with my teammates on the field, even after games, how I interact with people, you know, he's always watching. So I gotta make sure I set a good example. It's a good goal. I mean, a little bit of a defensive error there from Houston, but I mean, we'll take it. A goal's a goal. I mean, you still got to put that away for the keeper, so. Um, uh, I'm still feeling like uh, the emotions from it because, man, yeah, you work so hard especially as a striker, to score goals, score goals. And every every year in this league is getting harder and harder. So to finally true. reach 100 true. is like a dream come true. You know, once I entered this league, it's something I dreamed about, you know, being among the great strikers that have crossed this the, this league and has crossed the threshold, you know, for me. Um, with this, I'm just trying to inspire, you know, the next generation of players. Like, hey, I'm a guy from Hawthorne, California. You know, look at me, you know, I, I've done it. I'm gonna keep working, keep working hard to try to, to, try to keep climbing the, the ladder, you know, because uh, now that I've done it, um, I, I remind myself, you know, I have to keep going each and every single day because, you know, there's, there's another little kid that is, is looking up to me from the same hometown I might be from, you know, um, that's like, hey, Jossie went to the same high school. Jossie went, you know, and made it professional. I can do it, uh, you know? So um, that's what I'm trying to do. With everything I do, I'm trying to inspire. You can definitely see the, the longevity that he's had in his career going for all those plans for the national team, hearing from kids uh, that that look up to him. And it's it's great to see that that like is in his head always. And he's trying to be the best that he can, not only for himself and the team, but for just the soccer community in general, which is a huge thing growing the sport in the States. But I'm a big up Giassi. I mean, that's a hundred reasons to like Giassi's artists. hundred goals in the MLS. Let's hope he's going to continue. I, know, I mean, I know for a fact he's going to continue. He's not just going to give up and stop scoring goals. But uh, let me know down below who else on, who's the closest Austin FC player to scoring 100 career goals? Also, how many people have scored 100 career goals? Probably should know that. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have, please do feel free to go down below, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I promise, I know I say this every single time, I promise that there will be more videos on the channel coming soon. I've got some stuff working in, in the background, um, major, major stuff coming to the channel. So uh, that will be coming here in the next couple weeks, month. I don't know. But uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed. But take care. I'll catch you guys next time.